economy. I think he did a great job of what we talked about before, of telling people that he felt their pain and he understood what was happening out there. But he hit so many segments of society that he needed to talk to today, values of faith, values, family values, that uh, it was a great speech tonight. Fred Bannon, uh, you talked earlier about uh, sicking the pit bull, essentially, on the John McCain camp. He did that in a way that was both uh, diplomatic yet strong-willed. Yeah, I thought it was a very important speech because he did what the VP candidate's supposed to do, which is chew the bark off the other candidate. Okay. <laughs> and the other thing I think was important about that speech, it enunciated the theme for the campaign. All right, Brad, let me introduce, uh, interrupt you for a moment because, as you can see there, Barack Obama is making a, an appearance there on the stage with his running mate. And that is the Democratic ticket there for 2008, as you can see. Barack Obama apparently siding with our analyst here in the studio in telling him that that was an incredible, out-of-this-world speech. Hello, Democrats! I just wanted to come out here for a little, little something to say. I want everybody to now understand why I am so proud to have Joe Biden and Jill Biden and Bo Biden and Mama Biden and the whole Biden family with me on this journey to take America back. I think the convention's gone pretty well so far. What do you think? I think uh, Michelle Obama kicked it off pretty well, don't you think? If I'm not mistaken, Hillary Clinton rocked the house last night. In case you were wondering, I think President Bill Clinton reminded us of what it's like when you've got a president who actually puts people first. Thank you, President Clinton. We're going to be moving to Mile High Stadium tomorrow. And I want to let you know why. At the start of this campaign, we had a very simple idea, which is change in America doesn't start from the top up, top down, it starts from the bottom up. That the change is brought about because ordinary people do extraordinary things. And so we want to open up this convention to make sure that everybody who wants to come can join in the party and join in the effort to take America back. I think we are going to have a great night tomorrow night, and I look forward to seeing you there. God bless you. God bless America.